Donald Trump back in the courtroom today, criminal trial in Manhattan. The judge warned the former president he could face jail time if he keeps violating the gag order. Well, the jury saw evidence tying Trump to the payment to Stormy Daniels. Aaron Katursky is at the courthouse. Good morning, Aaron. George, good morning. Stormy Daniels is going to be the day's second witness. The defense is trying to limit the scope of her testimony, saying this is a case about documents and records. But prosecutors say it's important for the jury to understand Stormy Daniels and Donald Trump had sex, and that precipitated a $130,000 hush payment. For a tenth time, Donald Trump has been held in criminal contempt and slapped with a fine for violating the gag order. But the judge conceded monetary fines have not and will not deter Trump. So the judge warned future violations could land Trump in jail. This judge has given me a gag order and said you'll go to jail if you violate it. Trump is on trial for falsifying business records to keep an adult film actress's long-denied claim of a sexual encounter with Trump from voters before the 2016 election. His fixer at the time, Michael Cohen, wired Stormy Daniels the money. And when Trump paid him back, prosecutors said Trump illegally characterized the monthly reimbursements as legal expenses. For the first time, the jury seeing the invoices Cohen sent that asked for payment pursuant to the retainer agreement. Did you ever see a retainer agreement? Former Trump controller Jeff McConney was asked. He answered, I did not. Jurors also saw McConney's handwritten notes that worked out the monthly reimbursements and the checks Trump signed while at the White House. On cross-examination, the defense asked McConney, payments to lawyers by the Trump organization are legal expenses, right? He answered, yes, sir. Prosecutors said they're going to rest their case after about two more weeks of testimony, and that includes from witnesses like Stormy Daniels, who's going to tell the jury about a sexual encounter that Donald Trump says never occurred. Robin? All right. Thanks to you, Aaron.